This is playoff football. Never won state. Never won state. Somebody's going to give you one chance in life, and you're either going to make it or you're not. We really haven't been tested all year except for Cedar Hill. There's somebody out there, number one, that thinks you're soft. They think they're going to come in there and hit you in the mouth and make you quit. Even like looking back on it, I still don't really know what happened. They're going to know what exactly happened in Abilene, Texas. Even if everyone has like an off day today, like we could have an on day. Have you ever heard the term on day? Like I, I've heard like I was on today, but like I've never heard I'm going to have an on day. I'm going to have an on day today. Do you think you could chuck me? Um, do you think you could chuck me, um, oh, could chuck me or hurdle me? Hurdle. 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 Diego, I think you might be my best friend. I got lost. I would have slid. Actually, no, I wouldn't hurdle. <laughs> Do you ever go undefeated at Coppell? No, we just lost for one state. Coppell's never one state. I remember the Trinity. That's the rival I remember. Because the they were both football. they were both like the best teams in the state. One of the best high school football games I've ever seen. Yeah, the, the game winner. I was there. I was there. We really haven't been tested all year except for Cedar Hill. Except for all things. Even like looking back on it, I still don't really know what happened. Besides, you know, giving up 17 and two minutes. There was a touchdown, there was a touchdown that was called back. You had a punt block. Punt block, pick six. Without the punt block. Yeah, they scored, they scored 10 one, points. I think they scored one deep touchdown and an extra point or a field goal. So. Yeah, because I know we won the second half. I think, like, like, from the start of the second half of All Saints was when, like, we figured out our offense. Never know when it's going to be your turn to go in the game. And if you don't know what to do, you're going to look like an idiot. And I, that will, that'll be on you. Eyes up. And don't say, oh, I didn't get any reps or whatever. It's not the problem. I mean, that's not, that's not how life works. You get one chance. Somebody's going to give you one chance in life, and you're either going to make it or you're not. All right? I want to set the stage for you a little bit. We had an opportunity this Saturday to play at the Star. The reason they don't want to play at the Star is because he's confident he can kick your in Abilene. It's live bullets now, all right? You can get shot. There is no tomorrow. They think they're going to come in there and hit you in the mouth and make you quit. And they think we're a finesse football team that throws the ball around and does all this, doesn't play any defense, has a bunch of pretty boy guys that are rated, and he said all that kind of stuff. I don't think he really understands who is on this football team. You guys have heard me tell the Secretariat story over and over again. Once everybody realized Secretariat was a good racehorse, they tried all kinds of stuff to beat it. Get out in front of it, you know, make it run from ahead, all those kind of things to see if they could beat it. Nobody could beat Secretariat. Same type of deal here, all right? But I need you to understand, okay, that there's somebody out there, number one, that thinks you're soft, and they think they're gonna beat you. So I hope, and I know you guys will rectify that situation, so we shake hands at the end, right? They're gonna know what exactly happened in Abilene, Texas. And we're gonna punish them for not letting us play at the star. Hey. Hey. What y'all doing today? Gotta get a dub, hopefully at least. I mean, we prepared well, so we'll see. It's kind of crazy. It's my first time ever going to the playoffs, so I'm trying to soak everything in. We should win state, and we've been saying that since June, and nothing's changed. I think we're ready. How you feeling before this game? I feel healthy. I feel loose. If I ever find myself struggling tonight, I'll just think of my happy place.
But this is playoff football. This is what you've worked hard for the whole year to get to this point. You've earned the right to go out there, to have fun. The one thing I know about this room is we got some war daddies in here. So show it tonight the true meaning of what a war daddy is. And I told you this quote, when I need you the most, you gave me your best. Tonight is the night I need you the most. So give me your best. All right, let's go double tap. Take care of this. Welcome to Anthony Field on the campus of Abilene Christian University for tonight's second round matchup between the Parish Panthers and the Midland Christian Mustangs. Now start. First play of the game, Stone steps back, has a man Christian wide open. Oh, it is man. Benson. And after one play, they are into Mustangs territory, the 47 yard line. Ready, 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 ready. Now start. Stone going deep, has a man and is caught. It's Colt to the five, end zone, touchdown Panthers. Oh. Preston Stone showing off the cannon. 47 yards, Stone to Colt. Two play scoring drive and the Panthers strike first. It's my dog right there, it's my dog. Reverse! And he is met right away and is dragged down. Over his head. Yes. High snap goes over the punter's head. Safety, safety. Out of the back of the end zone, and it's going to be a safety. Panthers get two points. They now have an 8-0 lead, and they will get the ball back on the free kick. Now tight. Second round playoff action. And it's going to be a quarterback keeper. Stone makes a man miss, has some blocks, going back to the outside, to the corner, and is in for the touchdown. A 28-yard touchdown run from Preston Stone. Great read that time. Now a two-touchdown lead. Quick oh. pass almost intercepted. Come here. Hey, 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 who do you got in for him? I got it. You got it? I get him. Oh. Line drive kick. You're good, you're good. Fielded at the 40. Go, 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 go. Demers makes a couple of men miss and now has some room. One man to beat, sidesteps him. No one's going to catch him. That's another touchdown for the Panthers. Daniel Demery able to take it on the punt return for the score. And it's a three possession game. Rolling to the near sideline, has a man that's caught. Get to the flip in the middle of the field. Right there, Noah. Looks like the Mustangs are finally yep. getting it figured out. Where are you going? Sit in the flat! Man in motion. Stepping back as a man and got hit hard. Right at the 40, knocks it loose, Caleb Polk. 74 Shirley F post. 74 Shirley F post. We're coming to catch you, right. Radio now. Back, has time, has a man open over the middle. It's green and is caught past midfield and is knocked down at the 40 yard line. Backfield again, 12 seconds left. Stone stepping back. Now we'll make a run for it. There's six seconds left. He's going to get enough for the first down. He gets down at the 24 yard line. Three seconds on the play clock. Boyster will attempt a 41 yarder to give him a 24 0 lead into the break. It's a good snap, it's a good hold. Kick is up, has the plenty of leg, and that one is off the post. And good. Oh my goodness. <laughs> As we head into the halftime break, a 24 0 lead for the Panthers. The next part is to finish this. Do not let them up off the mat. Keep the throttle down. Nothing is done. There's a half a football left. Does everybody understand? Finish it. Let's go. And welcome back to Anthony Field. Now it's time. Stone looks, has a man. It's caught by Green, makes a man miss, and is able to walk into the end zone for a Panthers touchdown. 30 to nothing. Parrish leads this one. Oh. Kenneth Borders <laughs> and Ooh. Keegan Addison, and the duo will get a sack. Now it's time. Second down and two, they'll hand it off to Benson again. Is able to cut loose, go into the end zone, and is in. That's another touchdown, but this time it's Christian Benson. Make it 37 to nothing as we stand 
The Panthers lead this one over the Mustangs of Midland. Carlisle steps back, getting rushed immediately and is taken down Blatnick again. And that will do it as the Panthers defeat Midland Christian 44-6 and will advance to the state semifinals. This is a good one. It was a good win, but it's not the one we want. All right, that's a good first step. It's exactly what we want. It's a little rusty, but we had not played in two weeks, so that's fine. We'll clean it up next week and be back on our game. All right, proud of you guys. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Let's get Check these videos right here. Subscribe right there. And check out the link below right there. Heard you, cause you wanna get drippy like the drip gods. Oh, yeah. Damn -y -y. <laughs>